In today's video, I spent 24 hours in anime adventures on a brand new account and my goal was to see how OP I can get within the 24 hours. Now keep in mind, this challenge did take me a couple updates to finish, so do not be confused if my game does not look like yours. So the first thing we gotta do is create a username for the account and I have no idea what username I wanna choose at all. So after a couple minutes of trying to come up with a username, I finally came up with the username I'm for sure not Mars King. It's very original. So anyway, we finished setting up the rest of our account and we jumped into our first one hour of the challenge. All right, so right off the bat, we get a free unit and we got Sasuke. And this is the update we start on, update 3.0. So anyways, we waste no time and we go ahead and put in all our codes to gather as many free gems as possible. So the next thing I done was use those gems on the current banner with Blackbeard and Okira. And within the first five spins, we ended up getting Blackbeard. Dang, come to got Blackbeard on the first summon nuts that's crazy oh only if moz knew that blackbeard was actually crazy expensive and actually nowhere near as good so anyway i spent the rest of the first hour grinding out the first couple stages of planet namek until i decided it was time to spin for another unit because blackbeard was absolute doo-doo all right guys i'm gonna try to get ichigo he's really good for boss killing and using blackbeard for boss killing just is not sufficient enough so hopefully I get him within a couple of gems because I don't want to waste. Oh, there we go. All right, guys, we finally got to act six just as we're about to end the first hour. And we're about to defeat Frieza. Finally, this actually took a while. It took longer than I expected it to take. But here, guys, look at look at Ichigo. He's absolutely slicing through Frieza. That's actually crazy. All right, boys, so I actually made a lot of progress in the first hour. So second hour. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and quickly do Shinganchino District Act 1 Jaw Titan. Actually, never mind. We're not going to do that. We're just not going to play the game until the next update. So, yeah, guys, that was all the progress I made in update 3.0. But, yeah, now we're update 4.0. And it's Kingdom. And we're greeted with some free gems, which I'm going to go ahead and claim, obviously. So, right off the bat, I'm going to go ahead and also use the codes like I did last time. Oh, my God. This has to be, like, the worst banner ever. So, anyway, I ended up somehow getting past Act 1 and 2. I have no video evidence of that. But, yeah, it's, it was easy anyway. So, there's no way I cheated. Sure. No way. Cheat. We struggle trying to find a position to place Blackbeard. This is just how bad of a unit he is. Like he's just so bad. Look, at, look how. Oh my gosh! Look how long I'm taking to find a placement for this guy. So anyway, I spent the rest of hour two just grinding out Shinganshinu District all the way up to Act Five until you guessed it. I decided to stop playing until the next update. Um, guys, I can explain. Update five, Magic Town. Obviously, we're gonna go ahead and use the codes, get ourselves some free gems. Oh yeah, so guys, it's like this new quest board and basically what I can do with it, I can do these easy missions and I can get these tokens. Or basically what I can do with the tokens is, most of these items I can't even use, but I can buy the new XP food for the new story, which is actually gonna be really helpful for us because we're gonna be able to level up our units quick oh my gosh guys we got erwin and banner finally this is the one unit i need to actually carry us so i'm gonna go ahead and quickly get a summon ticket and we're gonna go ahead and summon so we got four summon tickets and a thousand gems can we get this guy can we get erwin can we actually get erwin are we that lucky right now nice what in the unlucky was that i guess now we gotta do our first infinite mode before the timer runs out so i'm gonna go ahead and quickly do infinite mode and namek hopefully we get to wave 50 because i need the 400 gems to be able to activate the pity and i can get erwin so time lapse Finally got everything maxed. Oh my god. Oh, okay. I, I think we, I think we can make it to wave 50. I'm not sure. This guy seems to be taking care of the guy. I 
And we add... Uh, wait, 44? 44? Yes, 44. Let's go. Well, technically that was 44. We have to get 44. Okay, we gotta hurry up. We got eight minutes. Eight minutes. Come on. All right, come on, guys. We gotta hurry up. I think this is enough gems for the pity. But we'll see. Come on, summon. Okay, so 92%. Okay. No. No. Okay, this is it. This is it, guys. The last one. Let's go. Finally, all for one unit. All for this one unit. All of that pain and struggle for one unit. Well, hopefully he's worth it. All right, guys, I'm gonna spend the next couple hours grinding these missions and gathering as many of these tokens I can get so I can get the XP units for the new story. And yeah, we'll be right back. Oh my god, bruh. Another update. Another day to grind. Android attack. Well, I won't be doing anything with this update as I'm too low level. Well, you guys already know what we do when there's a new update. Free gems. Also, there's a new Android code. And as of what I'm seeing in the Discord, I believe I get a free unit from this. Ooh. Okay, Mecha Freezer. Hopefully he's good because if he's good, then I'm gonna be able to use him because right now I have only Erwin. Erwin's the only good unit I have as of right now. And it's, it's kind of getting difficult to beat my story. So if this unit is actually good, then I'll be able to like speed through the story like even quicker. Also, let me go ahead and check if I can actually evolve this unit. Uh, no, I can't. Nice. So anyways, I spent the next couple hours just grinding story mode and mission board quests. All right, guys, after spending hours grinding them tokens, we finally have enough tokens to get a few XP units from the new mission board. So I'm gonna go ahead and get three, and I think I'll feed it to Frieza or Erwin. Uh, nah, I'm gonna feed it to Frieza. Probably will regret this, but let's keep going. Uh, boys, we finally made it to Ghoul City and we finally saved up enough of these tokens to now have 435 tokens. And I wonder what I'm gonna spend these tokens on. Yup, you guessed it, magical artifacts. Yes. Well, it's a new day to grind. I'm gonna go ahead and collect my free gems and spend the rest of the day grinding this game. Nice. Finally, I'm at hour 12 and I'm about to beat the owl. Hopefully we beat the owl and then we can move on to hollow world. Now this hollow world story was very difficult when the update dropped for me on my main account. So I have no idea how I'm supposed to complete this. It'll probably take me hours, but we'll see. So guys, after a lot of grinding, I finally beat hollow world act one and it seemed it seemed quite easy i feel like i might actually be able to beat the entire story so i thought new update update 6.0 cursed academy wow been three updates since the beginning well three big updates anyway well you guys already know what we do around here with new updates free gems 
Nice. Also, I'm liking this banner. I might actually summon on this banner because Gon is a very good mythic and he deals so much damage even as a legendary. Plus, I can evolve him into a mythic, which is a bonus. Plus, the mythic in the banner right now is part of the new update and he kind of has to be OP. Otherwise, it just wouldn't make sense. So, I'm definitely going to summon on this banner. So, summon tickets first. All right, I think I'm going to stop summoning after I get going because I don't want to waste too many gems and I want to kind of save up so I can get a mythic. So anyway, we continue with our story and we finally beat Act 4 in Hollow World. And like I'm saying, like it's, it's feeling it's feeling really easy. And then there goes Act 5. Now time for Act 6. Yeah, this is when things started to get difficult. So failure after failure, I finally came to the conclusion that I needed a new unit. And what other unit to summon for other than Dio. Now, those of you guys that don't know, Dio has the ability to stop time passively, which is going to be really, really helpful for us because it will stop Coyote from summoning those wolves. Also, I spent all my gems to try to get the mythic as well. But at least I did get a Nimble 2 Dio, which actually came in clutch a couple times. Just not this time. Here he is right now, bro. <sighs> New day. Hopefully we can beat Coyote. Also, I decided to summon for Jotaro just because he has a time stop ability and this one's manual. And why not have double time stop? Because this will surely work and I'll surely be able to beat Coyote this way. until this happened. Yes! Oh my god. Yup, we finally beat it after so many hours. And then I spent all my gems trying to get the man himself and yeah, spoiler alert, I didn't get him. So going into hour 19, I challenged myself to Beat Ant Kingdom Act 1 and yeah, I actually done it. Don't know why Ant Kingdom is a lot easier than Hollow World, but yeah, whatever. New update, Cursed Academy Part 2, update 6.5. Well, you guys already know what happens when a new update drops. Also, there's like this new NPC and I'm pretty sure he teleports you to the Infinity Castle and you can actually get a lot of gems from this and it's actually very easy. So I think what I'll do, I'll spend the next couple hours grinding this just to get my gems up and then we'll see what we'll do after that. All right, so we are going into hour 22 now and we just beat room 10 and we got five summon tickets so i guess that's good then i spent the next couple hours grinding Ant kingdom story i went through act two act three act four act five and act six yeah now nah, we feel like six i will try again but we are near to the end of the challenge all right guys the 24 hour mark has been reached and we finish up with 2798 gems 7100 coins 20 of these tokens if they're even still in the game when i put this this video and coincidentally we actually ended up being level 24 that's crazy anyways so i did actually have a lot of fun doing this no i didn't wow well, i'm lying no i didn't this was like the most boring grindy thing i've ever done but yeah if you guys want to see a 50 hour video smash a thousand likes on this video otherwise there's not zero percent chance i'm doing a 50 hour video because i already don't even want to do it but if, if you know what if you guys really like this video then i'll end up doing a 50 hour video if you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to subscribe smash the like button and yeah see you guys all in the potential 50 hour video peace